wake up. It's the first of the month. How are you doing Western Slope? I'm Dalen Brazelton. Happy Friday. Let's talk about the weather folks. We're going to be seeing some dry conditions to start your weekend before we start seeing some possible precipitation happening on Sunday, leading into some definite precipitation Sunday evening leading into Monday. We've also got some snow possible up on the mountains right now. About four to eight inches are projected at the moment. And of course, with it now being November, we are going into the freezing overnight temperatures pretty consistently. So let's talk about today. We're currently sitting at 34 degrees in Grand Junction with the sun expected to rise in just about two hours here. And I want to remind everybody that even though the sun is setting at 612 right now, we got daylight savings coming up on Sunday, so make sure to re Rewind those clocks back one hour, get a little bit of extra sleep going on. But a look ahead for this weekend, it's looking pretty good for Friday and Saturday in Grand Junction. You're not seeing a whole lot of crazy wind speeds or troughs or anything leading into Friday into Saturday, but that will change as we go into Sunday where you can start seeing a bit of an intense pickup uh, and where Grand Junction is starting to sit into that higher wind speed from the southwest troughs. Temperatures right now, though, looking beautiful over the western slope, 34 in Grand Junction, 28 in Montrose, Moab even sitting in the 30s and over on the eastern side of the western slope here, Gunnison sitting at 18 degrees right now. Ooh, it's a chilly start to your morning and it's only going to get a little bit warmer as we go into the next 12 hours. Expected to peak in the upper 50s, maybe not even hitting 60s quite at 3 p.m. And that, of course, could be subject to change here. Today is the only day in the next five days where we are sitting above average temperatures. Everything else over the next five days really starting to dip until we get to Wednesday here where we're sitting at 48 degrees for the high. So Wednesday is going to be super chilly. Uh, Monday even going to be 25 degrees. So overall pretty cold, but still pretty dry conditions uh, over the entirety of the western slope. The I-70 corridor sitting in the 50s pretty comfortably. Delta even getting into the 60s for your highs for today. Tomorrow you're getting a little bit warmer even with Grand Junction sitting at 64. Montrose also hitting up the 60s. Moab getting a little bit warmer as well here. So this weekend we're seeing pretty clear conditions going into Friday and Saturday, but folks check this out. When we go into Sunday, you're seeing a little bit of that precipitation really starting to hit Grand Junction and Western Colorado as a whole. For your bus stop forecast here, make sure those kiddos have a jacket because we are getting below freezing temperatures for their drop off time. But make sure they come back with those jackets because it's going to warm up super intensely by three o'clock here. Pretty steep uh, curve there, uh, so just make sure that they're always coming home with those jackets here. The lows are getting pretty low tonight as well, but let's talk about the next week here. That Discovery Auto seven day forecast, clear conditions for Friday and Saturday before you start seeing that pretty big chance of showers on Sunday leading into Monday as well. We got election day coming up on Tuesday, folks. Make sure you vote Montrose slightly cooler freezing temperatures happening in the overnight hours pretty consistently for the next week and maybe even seeing some snow on Monday, but overall should be a good weekend.